Welcome to Down at the Barns, following the story of people and their love of classic cars, everything from restoration to electric conversion. Okay, welcome to Down at the Barns. Please subscribe to the channel in the link below. Now, we've got a special thing behind us here. We've got the stag back at the barns, and Nick and I are about to reveal it. Let's go, Nick. Do you think? It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. It's like a brand new car. It is a brand new car. I yeah. pretty much, uh, well, every piece of rust has been cut out of it. It's had some new panels put in. And let's tell you, there's not a piece of filler on it, which is pretty there amazing. There is no filler. It really, the detail has been quite it's, amazing. It's really, everything. Really, it's beautiful. It's All the lines that have been cut in are really, really nice. Yeah. yeah. Um, you'll know that Les has been pretty consistent about what he wants. Um, but he's now changed his mind. Brilliant. What yeah. does he want now? What does he want? What, what does he want? Um, so he's, he's, moved, he's changed what batteries he wants, right? So he was going to put used cells in the car. We're now going to move to new cells. So similar to what we use in all the other cars. It also gives him the advantage of significantly better power density. So he'll get a much better range out of the car um, and a smaller battery pack in there. So we've ripped up and threw away all the designs we had for battery pack. No big deal. Uh, the rear is easy. That's six modules flat in the boot. That's all done. Up the front here, slightly more complicated because it's not just adding a new different battery pack in here. Les has decided to go and put air conditioning on the car. Yeah, because the air conditioning, that's really unusual, isn't it? It wasn't a standard fit for Stag, no, by any means. Uh, I think it was a, a special option for um, the Middle Eastern markets. Uh, and this car had it on, right? So putting it back on is appropriate. Uh, just gives me a headache, that's <laughs> all. So, so I've got to find extra space to put the, com you know, the compressor, the dryer, the evaporator, uh, sort of the condenser in the front. And then we've got the, the, we're not going to use the original evaporator, we're going to adapt the, um, the, the heater box to, to fit a new one in. But yeah, there's going to be a whole new AC system in here, which we haven't done before from an electric point of view. So it's a challenge, but a good challenge to have, and it will add something else to our our portfolio of uh, parts and um, capabilities. So I'm, lo I'm looking forward to that. It's a challenge, but hey, why not? And what are you going to do regarding not getting any scratches on the actual car? It'd be much easier if we hadn't, if we'd done all that before. But anyway, we didn't. Um, main thing is to protect it. So you can see we've put a little bit, we've, we've been playing around with um, fake battery boxes, just trying to package things up. Um, it's difficult getting that right though, isn't it? Jigsaw puzzle, which bits yeah, to do first. Yeah, which bits to do first, right? I mean, yeah. but yeah. We're just going to have to tape, tape everything up and make sure we protect it because it is such a lovely paint job for him. Mm. So we can see the light at the end of the tunnel. So join us again soon down at the barns. Mm.